Hey guys, Anthony here for Signal by Sony, a show about everything Sony makes. We are at San Diego Comic Con 2012. It's like the biggest nerd event in the universe. And we thought we would ask some of the people from Sony's biggest TV shows and upcoming films about their nerdy dreams. Come on, let's go dream nerdy, everybody. Nerd dreams. If you could have any sci-fi gadget at all, what would it be? Well, I would want the Millennium Falcon or the Enterprise, the DeLorean. Yeah. What's the DeLorean? It's the time machine in Back to the Future. Oh, sick. Hoverboard. Why hoverboard? Hoverboard. That's <laughs> I mean, a hover car would be a hover car. I mean, still, though, I'd still I'd see your hover car and raise your hoverboard from Back to the Future. I would give my wife, I think the we, we have this, this uh, implant cell phone within your hand that, that we created for this film. I'd give that to her because she always loses her cell phone, so that would be fantastic for me. What movie has teleporting? That's what I want. I would want uh, a, trans a transporter. I would want to be able to just beam myself, like yes. in, in, in Trekkies. I want to Myself, I would, man, what would I really like? I would, any kind of teleporting device. Teleporting Star Trek, Star yeah. Trek, I would really, I'll tell you because it's all just about time. <laughs> Is there anything that can make me invisible? Sure. Yeah, Is there a I'm gadget? Sure I'm sure there's a gadget somewhere. Invent it if it hasn't been. <laughs> that's what I'd want. I mean, a lightsaber, it would be hard not to have a lightsaber. Yeah, just sure. because, but I, it's a very violent weapon, you know? To have an actual lightsaber just mostly for household chores, that's just for thing. weeding. And like, I, I have a yard right now. We have some, like, yeah. just these old, dirty ferns that are yeah. growing in my yard. That lightsaber would dominate and just clean yeah. it up in a jiff. The thing from Men in Black to erase people's memories. Why? Because I put my foot in my mouth all the time, <laughs> and it'd really be great to have people not remember the awkward things I say. I, I'd probably have Doctor Who's payphone. Yeah. I mean, that's that seems like that. That seems like that could do the most. That's kind of like an all-in-one gadget. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. you could probably do that, or I would have like a replicator. Like a like a gun that you shoot people with, and then it makes them tiny. Why tiny? Because then I could like put them in my pocket and take them with me everywhere. Is it biased if I say uh, the gun that Vickers has that can kind of turn you into pulp in District 9? Would you go past or future? Past. Yeah, why yeah. past? I don't know, I feel like I was born in the wrong era. Yeah? <laughs> you feel like you'd, you'd fit in a little more? I do. I can't decide whether it's the 60s or, you know, those times where you didn't have any plumbing and toilets. I just don't know. Probably past, because I could make a killing in the lottery. I think I would go back to, ooh, I would say dinosaurs, because I've always wanted to hunt them. Let's go forward. Future. Why future? Because the unknown is more exciting than the known. Yeah? Yeah. Future. Oh, God, no, just to see what things are going to be like in 100 years. I imagine you could go backward and have a pretty interesting, you know, like investment strategy that would lead you to become a tycoon pretty quickly. But you'd essentially be hanging around with a bunch of dead people. I would definitely go future. Yeah? i go future. I feel like I was, I was very happy with my past. There's nothing I necessarily want to fix. Oh, I'd go into the future, yeah. man. Yeah, I'd go into the future. How come? Because um, I want to see what happens, and I'm planning on dying young. <laughs> that just took a real weird turn, man. There's so much going on here at Comic Con 2012. For more of everything Sony has going on at the convention, be sure to head to youtube.com/slash signal.